I've been using the AirPods Pro mainly for running and working out. So here are my five top reasons why you should definitely pick these up. Welcome back to my channel, I'm Steve Bunn, your qualified personal trainer. Each week I bring you the latest fitness tech and workout programs, so please consider subscribing as it really does help me out. What I really like about the AirPods Pro is the transparency mode. If I go for a run in those dark early mornings or late in the evening, then having snug fitting headphones can really prevent you from hearing the outside world which is great if you like your music really loud as it really does keep you motivated for working out or during a run, but it prevents you from hearing any traffic coming when crossing the road quickly during your run. So with your AirPods Pro, all you have to do is simply press and hold the stem to activate transparency mode. This uses the built-in microphone to amplify outside noise, so at least you can be aware of exactly what's going on around you as and when you need it. Now transparency mode is also a great little feature when you're working out in the gym. As when you do have music playing and someone does come over to have a conversation with you, then all you have to do is activate transparency mode and at least you can hear the volume of your own voice. So you can then hold a conversation with someone without shouting at them. Two, unlike the standard AirPods, the AirPods Pro actually stay in your ear. So if you are looking to save yourself some money by going with the standard AirPods, don't pay the extra and go with the AirPods Pro. Don't get me wrong, you can save yourself some money with the standard AirPods for everyday use, which I would recommend them for. On the other hand though, if you're looking to pick up some AirPods for fitness as well, then definitely go with the Pro version. You get three silicon tip sizes to choose from to give you a better fit and with the new angled shape, they stay in your ear even when you go for a run and they're perfect for working out in the gym. Plus they are really light and you do forget they are in your ear. The only time I personally felt the AirPods Pro start to slip out was on a treadmill run doing interval training at max speed. This was only because it was the sheer vibrations of the treadmill that made the AirPods Pro start to feel like they were slipping out. On a normal run though, I had no problems. So for outdoor running instead, you'll definitely have no problems. The speed and how easy the AirPods Pro actually connect to your iPhone really is quite something. No longer do you have to constantly go searching into your Bluetooth settings as you try to repair your headphones back to your phone again. All you have to do with the AirPods Pro is simply just open up the AirPods Pro case and you're instantly connected. As soon as you open that case, you get all the information that you need, including how much battery is left for each of the AirPods Pro and the charging case itself. More on the charging case in a minute. So when you can just open up the AirPods Pro case and it instantly be connected to your phone, this really is a time saver. Number four, noise cancellation. If transparency mode really isn't your thing and you do like shutting the outside world out, then the noise cancellation in the AirPods Pro really is amazing. Just like with the transparency mode, all you have to do is press and hold to cycle between transparency mode and active noise cancellation. And with noise cancellation on, you really do shut the outside world out. So with the active noise cancellation on, it really does keep you in the moment when you're going for a run, working out at home, or simply just chilling out at home, watching a movie in peace with no outside distraction. The wireless charging case for the AirPods Pro really is small and perfect for carrying around on a day-to-day -day basis in your pocket. With the AirPods Pro out of the wireless charging case, you will get four and a half hours listening time in one full charge. If for some reason you actually manage to use a full four and a half hours continuous use and you do run out of battery, then just put the AirPods Pro back into the wireless charging case and with only five minutes of charging, you'll get a further one hour use. The wireless charging case can store up to 24 hours of listening time in total, allowing you to charge the AirPods Pro multiple times inside the case, without the wireless case having to be plugged in. Subscribe to the channel if this video has helped you out. I'm Steve Bonnie, helping you to get fit at home or on the go.